Hi, today I'm going to be uh, discussing the uh, this demonstrator uh, module here we made for the Airpel AB cylinder. The Airpel AB uses a frictionless piston inside of an air cylinder configuration and this uh, I'm holding here is an example of a finished Airpel AB. This is a 16 millimeter bore, 80 millimeter stroke Airpel and uh, uh, you know, rod comes out of the front nose with some clearance and there's also a ball and socket joint at the end of the rod. The idea is to provide a, uh, uh, a pure force without friction. And uh, to demonstrate it, the, uh, we came up with this uh, uh, demonstrator here to uh, to show what's happening inside the Airpel AB. Now inside this particular Airpel AB, this 16 millimeter bore, is uh, the working cylinder, Pyrex glass. So it's ideally suited uh, because of its transparency to see the, how the piston's working. So this demonstrator here has this same cylinder uh, inside there. It's a little hard to see and then there's an outer Lexan tube. So what we have for the demonstrator is a uh, small aquarium pump. It puts out about two PSI um, running through a line and then a filter um, uh, to a needle valve to, so we can um, change the pressure um, to the underside of that piston. And right now I'm going to uh, plug in the aquarium pump. So if my assistant, can you please plug in the aquarium pump please? Okay, just takes a second to get the pressure up. I'll adjust the needle valve here to add a little more air in. And you can see we've already generated enough pressure to counteract the weight of the uh, piston rod assembly here. It works out to about one PSI, um, or very approximately uh, 0 0.01 megapascal, a little bit less than that. Um, so the, the, uh, the demonstrator isn't that impressive, you know, there's no way to show that it's frictionless. So we came up with the idea of, of using this very thin crossbar and the idea is if, if the piston is frictionless along its motion of axis, it's also going to be frictionless um, when rotating about that motion of axis. So we have this uh, just way to put a um, a small torque around the piston and you can see it spins quite freely and I'm going to try to zoom in a second here you'll see the noise of the motor of the digital camera and it, it spins quite happily it, it does slow down eventually from from the viscous air drag uh, between the piston and cylinder it's a very thin film there um, but it really only stops when uh, the piston bottoms out. Um, so, and, and that's what it just, just did. So that's the idea. So the, 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 the point of the, the demonstrator is not that we're providing frictionless rotary motion. That's just a, a side benefit which um, is probably not useful to our customers. But just as a way to, to demonstrate uh, the frictionless nature of the piston, um, we, we, we've come up with this system. Um, and so that's, that's pretty much what's happening inside of the Airpel cylinder um, when you put pressure in it. Typically you're putting much higher pressures than one PSI. Um, and uh, that's what we have. Uh, so thank you for watching.